This video is sponsored by TeamViewer. In a lot of ways, January kind of feels like it was three decades ago. The world is a super different place than it was, and I'm not sure that businesses are ever going to run the way they did, you know, like 10 weeks ago. Uh, and mine is no exception. So TeamViewer is an application that I've been using sort of since this pandemic time almost every single day. And I've used it for business and I've used it to help my family. And there's a lot of really cool use cases, I think, for other people out there. So let me tell you how I'm using it and how I think it can help you either start your business while you're at home or help businesses that are already existing save a lot of money, but take advantage of everybody having extra time while they're at home. So one of my favorite ways to use TeamViewer is with my iPad Pro. So I thought I could give you guys a chance to experience it the same way. So we are giving away a brand new 11 inch, 128 gig iPad Pro. Stay tuned to the end of the video to learn how to enter, but spoiler alert, you're gonna have to give this video a like. So in case you guys don't know, TeamViewer is a single application with like a bunch of different uses, but probably chief among them, the one I use more than anything is the ability to remote access computers. So it's super easy to do, whether you're on a laptop, a tablet, or even your phone. You just download the TeamViewer application. You don't even have to set up an account if you don't want to. Uh, and once you have it all up and running, you're going to get a computer ID and a password. And whoever else is trying to remote access your computer or vice versa, you type in that ID, you type in the password, and you have access to their computer. You can see what they see. You can see the screen sharing. You can take control if you have to download apps or show them how to use video chatting. That's really all it takes. From having nothing installed to being able to remote access, you're probably looking at about a two minute process. Uh, it's completely encrypted, totally end to end, and every session has its own password. So it's not like if you log into somebody's computer once, you can always log back in. But it's level of security with it too, so you know who's coming into your computer to make sure that you know it's safe and secure. And also, if you're not using it for business, it's completely free, uh, which is absolutely amazing. Now you can buy a business license and unlocks a bunch of new features. But if you need to help your parents or help your grandparents, uh, this suite of applications will not cost you a penny, uh, which is amazing. So the reason that I wanted to work with TeamViewer uh, was after some personal experiences. Uh, so the first, I am fortunate enough that my grandparents are still with me. They are 90 and 91 years old, living in a retirement community that is obviously under really tight lockdown. I wanna have communication with them and talk to them, but as you might expect, technology is not really their strong point. So when they moved into this new community about a year ago, I set up a computer for them and I put TeamViewer on so I could remote log in and help them if they ran into any issues. So now after COVID-19 hit, they wanted to FaceTime and see my daughter and see my kids. I was able to remote log into their computer, show them how to work FaceTime. And now I talk to my grandparents almost every day via video. That's something that I wouldn't be able to do uh, if it wasn't for this kind of cool software. And sort of on another personal story, uh, my father, and like a lot of people out there, have doctor's appointments. And it was a telemedicine doctor appointment. And he had to install a Chrome app and a few plugins in order to get this thing to work. So I was able to log into his computer, download the application, get everything working, show him how to do it for doctor's appointment the next day. That was a really cool opportunity and a cool use of the software personally. All right, so here's how we're using TeamViewer for the business, the personal stories aside. So if we have to upload a video, I can log in our producer to the channel dashboard. You can log in from my computer here if I'm not at home. Could, again, let the directors log in, grab the footage that they need, and they can leave edits for me on my desktop that I can go back and look at later. It's made collaboration a lot simpler and easier. Uh, we're also using TeamViewer for our now seemingly daily conference calls for video chatting. Everything's kind of integrated into one platform uh, and it's just been really simple and elegant for us to use. So that's how I've been using TeamViewer to 
be my family's tech support and to keep my business running and keep the content coming and most importantly to keep my staff employed it's changed the way i've run my business in this new climate and if you are like me and you've had to change the way you do your job or you're looking for new jobs team viewer is an awesome way to do pretty much everything that you used to do before just in a different way uh, if you want to learn more about it or check it out we'll link to team viewer down below so I mentioned towards the beginning of the video, we are going to do a giveaway to help promote TeamViewer and let you guys use the application in my favorite way. And that is with my iPad Pro. So this is open to anyone in the world. As long as you live on this planet, you can win a 11 inch, 128 gig iPad Pro or the cash equivalent if it's not available wherever you are. It's pretty easy to enter. So give the video a thumbs up and subscribe. We appreciate all that stuff. But down below, there'll be a link to my website, johnforlakers.tech. Click that, you go over and see a widget there. You can pick how you want to enter. We will pick one single winner. We'll let the giveaway run for two weeks and then we will reach out to said winner and let them know how they want to get their brand new iPad. Hope you guys enjoy and good luck.